Hey guys, welcome to our live reaction for Kyoko Suiri, episode 1. I'm Hells and joining me is Kelly. Hello. So, this series in the English version is actually a pun. In English, it's called Inspector. Like, you know, someone who inspects things. Except instead of I N S P E C T O R, it was Spectre, as in like a ghost activity thing. Oh. And I don't know why they did that, but I'm not even sure if Kyoko Suri actually directly translates to Inspector, but whatever. Anyway, uh, let's start in three, two, one, go. Oh, on another note, I actually follow this series in the manga version. I don't. Please. Is it raining or is it fogging? What's going on? I'm sure it's raining, but she seems to be outside and not affected. Oh, okay. So oh. It seemed a bit bright for it to be like raining. Why did you catch him with your body instead of your hand? Because her hand is not strong enough. Oh, it's a different game. Yeah, the one she's using now is like a round top. Yeah. Why a goat? I go. How did you come into the deduction? I don't think she's a good detective. Oh, I don't think he's a good detective either. Neither. That's only been two years. I remember you. You are the girl with no beret. Seventeen. He seems pretty. Very thin. Her face reminds me of Kesson character. Reminds me of Idol Master, if you ask me. No, no, not, not specifically her face, the way she's drawn. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> what the 
Cut the face. Oh, how sweet. Why are they gossiping about a patient? A patient son. Well, it's not exactly the patient. Yeah, it's the patient's relatives. Uh, I think yeah. it's fine. I think. That's even worse. <laughs> You're gossiping not even about the patient. Yeah, you know. Did you have something to do with this? Yeah, it's the it's the first turn, not the fish. Oh. <laughs> What's that picture just now? Why was it so terribly sketched? Like it was just a sketch. It wasn't like a finished picture or anything. Like What's her name again? Her name? Kotoko uh, Iwanaga. There's no name or anything. Kotoko? Ha uh, ha uh, ha. Uh. Uh, I guess you can call her a lolly. Like, she's... 17 is a legal age, right? In Japan, it's 13, is it? The age of concern. They can drink at 21, but I don't know about the age of concern. I thought it was 17 or 18. Wow, how great for you. Ah, finally, some demon. Does a cup count as a demon? I know it's a yokai. But like... I mean, shouldn't you call like the FBI or? Someone. Ghostbuster! Does the cup and the skills? Maybe? Maybe. Uh, wow, this is very different. Ouch, okay.
Hey, health. Mm-hmm. It's like reverse bench. bench. <laughs> um, We are talking about Oizuki. I know, I know. But like, I don't think it's the exact same bench. I think this one's a bit longer. Yeah, I think so too. The couple looks pretty scared. Mm. Wait, didn't he run? Nah, nah, nah. So the contradiction was between who who was the one that was scared? The kappa or him? Why not both? Yeah, that's the that's the part they were disagreeing with. I'll talk more about it after the episode ends. Okay. But let me just tell you this before you go more than one episode later, yeah? This is a very slow anime. Very slow series, I should say. Yeah, no crap. We spent like 10 minutes and we don't get any yokai. You got the kappa. Before, yeah, before the kappa. And you got that thing that was pulling her skirt. Man, it's like what? It's like Tulu mythology or something. They kidnap a girl, turn her, turn her into a goddess. There you go. That's a lot of yokai. I have no idea what those are. That. These are oh, that's adorable. Original yokai. That thing just now was adorable. Probably they're, they're just Jimmy Mori or something. It sounds very different from the start, by the way. Yeah. Wait, is that why you're holding a cane? Ah, uh, the you'll get the explanation in a bit. In a bit. Okay. Yeah, it's a very good uh, prosthetic. Yeah, really good. It's like they can bend and move by her will. Oh, Miasma. Spider Man. Sp- oh, wait, never mind. Uh, end of period Spider Man. Yeah, oh, it is okay. yeah, as in like, I wonder if that's from the subtitle though, and not actually in the original. Because yeah. Inspector is actually the official English name. So. What's it at hand? What, what do you mean? He is a human. He was a human, right? Mm-hmm. This guy he used to be a human, right? He's not just he's just a ghost, not even a yokai. Mm. You'll understand by the end of this episode, Eric. Right? Oh.
Wait, one daughter? This is her when she was found five years ago. It was at six. It was two weeks after the kidnapping that she mentioned. Wow, she doesn't age. She does. She She's doesn't change. She's just a lolly. She just become full metal. <laughs> but instead of an arm, she was an eye. And a leg. Yeah, yeah the leg is lost. Yeah, and then he also lost the leg. But, oh, it's adorable. Wait, does the does the other chick not realize that that thing was flipping on his own? I guess so. Yeah, that I got six years ago. It's a very small bucket Danuki. It might as well just be regular Danuki. Mm. Wait, he didn't see the Taroki? He does. That's why he said he believes her now. But because she was asking for help, he doesn't wanna, so he wants to leave. Yeah, it's that guy from yesterday. <laughs> oh, it's your only. Okay. Wait, what? Uh, 
Does that count? Okay, that one might. Man, for one leg girl, she's very agile. Hey, the other I got her. Yeah, it, she says she has one leg and the other one is a prosthetic, but it really doesn't feel that way, right? Because yeah. she basically just walks or runs however she wants. And if her pupil can change size, it means her eyes is not prosthetic either. Mm, yeah. Why? Is he mortal or something? Is that cool? Wow. What's an Usioni doing in public library? Yeah, I guess. Mermaid. Is the opening? Did we get an opening or is the ending? Nah, maybe it's opening. Hmm. So maybe mermaid and the poison yokai? Mm. Oh, we'll see later, right? Yeah. But you are correct, I mean, uh, the meat, yes, it is mermaid. Because that's why he got the regeneration power. So here's the thing about this series, right? Uh, you remember about the first time they had the debate? Ah, uh, sorry, not debate, I guess. It's more like uh, opposing point of view, whether it who was scared, the kappa or him. Yeah. yeah, that's the kind of mystery that this series handles. Like basically they have uh, an oddity happening and then they try to figure out what was actually happening through uh, through different analysis point of views. Wow, so they're really nitpicky. Kind of like in the Phoenix Wright. Yes. Yeah, very nitpicky. Like, <laughs> I don't know what's going to be the first arc of this series, but if it goes along with the manga... Okay, okay they didn't. Okay, they skipped it. Okay, they fuck with that. <laughs> Okay, they skipped the first arc of the book, which is just good. <laughs> Why? Because in the first arc of the book, okay, it was six books. Wow. Yeah. The Can first six books was this chapter. And then just one super long case. Oh, they might not skip it. Then. Maybe they just save it for later. Maybe, but yes, this wasn't the first case they handle in the book. Let me just put it that way. 
uh, yeah, I was the the reason I didn't think that this series of all series would get an anime adaptation was because the first thing they did was this chapter where they got the two characters to meet up, and then their first case was a super ass, a super long ass case, <coughs> like. <coughs> <clears throat> Sorry. Like the resolution of that case by itself was like a book and a half. So I was like, how the oh. hell are you gonna fit that into one anime? Like that case by itself is probably about a season. So so I didn't know how if they were gonna make an anime, how they can do that. But they just get it, which is good. So you wouldn't get bored just watching like one case for the entire season. Good. Is it even a good case? Or is it even an important case? Um, personally, I think the setup was really well done for uh, that how case. It is, how, how it is handled? How, is it an important case? Like, uh, you know, the last directive anime we watch, case files. It's, it's the earlier uh, case are not very important at all. Uh, it was like their first case because it's linked to the overarching uh, thing they are doing. Oh, so kind of important. Then. It's sort of important, but it was way too long, and the it doesn't 100% connect to that thing anyway in the end, so it's okay to skip. They can just mention the thing later, I feel like. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> but it was very interesting. Like, I read that thing, I I had like a bit of interest in the series because I was scrolling through the uh, book uh, bookstore and this series looked interesting and I was like I was reading the back uh, synopsis and then I was like yeah this looks interesting and then five books later I was like really we're still in the first case and then ever since then. Uh, book seven and ten has been multiple cases per book, which is really. Good. And I think we're just skipping to book. Was it six or seven? This one. So yeah, we're, we're skipping ahead, and I feel like that's good because that one was slow, very slow. But yeah. Uh, but the whole thing about this series is not like there is a case. And then they're trying to 100% find out what actually happened. It's more like something weird happened. And then they're trying to figure out what actually happened. But they didn't confirm in the end, was it X or Y or Z that happened. They just go with like, does this conjecture make sense? Which is very sparking your imagination in a way. Which I really like. Anyway, that's it for Inspector Episode 1. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.